From the 700 WLW Newsroom, here's Brian Combs. Big stories we're talking about. The big one today, making Columbia Parkway more safe. Several members of Cincinnati City Council holding a news conference this morning. They're talking about ways to slow traffic down, ways that they can maybe divide the parkway a little bit so that you don't have the crossover accidents like the one that we had earlier this week, critically injuring the Cincinnati police officer. Today was the day the charges were finally filed in connection with the injuries to Sergeant Ron Shaper. Ray Weathers, the man Behind the wheel of the car that hit Shaper has been charged with aggravated vehicular assault. New numbers out today on home sales in the Tri-State, and they show the slow economy continues. Realtors in the Tri-State not selling as many homes this June. National numbers were down as well. That's contributing to the big slide on Wall Street today. We've seen the Dow go down about 450 points at midday. Stay with 700WLW and 700WLW.com for the latest on the Dow, which way the market is heading. Talk tomorrow of a meeting to try and make some changes to Senate Bill 5 before that issue goes to a vote in Ohio. Governor John Kasich a couple of months ago told our Bill Cunningham that he had no interest in discussing this issue with union leaders. Now he wants to meet with those labor leaders. However, they are very skeptical going into this meeting. They say the only thing they'll sell for at this point is a complete repeal of Senate Bill 5. Otherwise, they say the vote is on come November. 700 WOW Reds update. Johnny Cueto looked great again last night. National League ERA leader beating the Washington Nationals 2-1. to one. Reds wrap up that series with Washington tonight. Airtime 6.05 despite the Reds win last night. Can't make up any ground on the Brewers who continue to win. More tennis action today. Big names on center court in Mason at the Western and Southern Open as the tournament continues down to the best 16 men and women now. Leading off things today on center court is Rafael Nadal in the first match. He'll be followed by a match involving Maria Sharapova. After that, it's jo Novak Djokovic, the number one men's seed tonight. Roger Federer on center court, last year's champion, to take on James Blake.